grab a ball, set up a net, and get your game face on. Here we go. Let's get it on. It's time for chair volleyball at the Southeast Seattle Senior Center. It's fun. It keeps you laughing. It keeps you moving. Marietta Greaves is here every Thursday afternoon with more than a dozen of her friends, a designation that most often includes her sister, Donetta. She can hit the ball, and I'm on the other side of that net, and she's aiming for me, and I know it. What started as a simple chair exercise class turned into this much more intense six players per side beach ball game about two years ago as a way to help the more than 600 older adults who come to this center to do more than visit. People who are not seniors, they assume that all seniors want to do is to knit, crochet, and eat jello. That is so far from the truth. That's Linda Green. <laughs> executive director of the senior center and sometimes chair volleyball player. She knows that across this net, participants are scoring some big points toward their health. It is so much more than just a game. Census figures show 28% of us aged 65 or older live alone, which can lead to isolation and poor health. That's why the senior center, which touts itself as one of the most diverse in the city, is reaching out with events like this to help people from every walk of life. We respect all ethnic groups and we encourage people to come. The motto that we use is you may come to the center as a stranger, but you will definitely leave as a friend. It's the reason Donetta Gillum comes every week. That's why we do it, because it, it doesn't matter what your age is. You know, as long as you're active, that's how you make a hundred years old. And as it turns out, Annabelle DeCure is living proof. I made a hundred in December, <laughs> so I'm over a hundred. Let's get it on. What keeps this centenarian going? A group of players who support her. I love them. They take good care of me. They help me to, to hit the ball and, and have the ball go where it's supposed to go. Now, on that whole getting the ball where it's supposed to go thing, Sitting volleyball is a competitive game with an actual volleyball and no chairs that's been around since 1956, a Paralympic sport since 1980. Chair volleyball for seniors, the beach ball version, has been around for about a decade. <laughs> but this is one of the few, if not the only, organized version of the game in Seattle. And figuring out the exact guidelines of how to play isn't always easy. Uh, no. The rules are actually more like suggestions. Standing up, if you can balance yourself, that's fine. Hitting it off the ceiling, sure, why not? But at the end of every point, the smiles and a good workout are guaranteed. As long as you have a ball and you're playing it, you think more fun than exercise, but it's definitely an exercise as you get into it. We are far superior players. They built up this confidence and now it's, they're strategizing, which is awesome, and they're really playing with intensity. One problem, though, what are the team t-shirts going to look like? We tried to get Mark to put us in bikinis, but he wouldn't do that. So we still have to discuss uniforms. OK, so that needs some work. But if you're ready to have so much fun, you can't even stand it, oh, wait, 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 wait. have a seat with some seniors serving up a great time. They are so supportive of one another. If they didn't see someone last week and they're coming back, well, where were you? We missed you. So everybody feels like they are a part of the family that we form here at our center. All right. Watch City Stream Thursday nights at 7 on the Seattle Channel. Or get video on demand and podcasts anytime at seattlechannel.org.